What is going on my individuals? Dre Drexel here. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to today's video. Right now I have 11 back to school outfit ideas that'll definitely improve any student's style game. So kicking it off with number one, we have box fit tees. Now this is a perfect option for those of you who are looking just to stay comfortable or if you're just simply looking to switch things up. They're loose, breathable, and more stylish than any other tee out there. And for my skinnier dudes, these shirts will actually make you appear bigger. This specific one that you see here is from Wings of Liberty. The material is super stretchy and very comfortable. Number two, we have jersey shorts. Now these are very reliable when it comes to style and comfort. I would definitely go with jersey shorts that fit above the knee, mainly because it's more in style and it will complement your look as a whole. I recently just picked up a bunch of new shorts from a few of my favorite brands, including Collar Clothing. The quality on these bad boys right here are absolutely amazing. Number three, now as I'm sure a lot of you know, I am a huge penny pincher. Before before I buy anything, I usually wait till a sale occurs or I just search the entire internet to find the best deal. So a great app that I've been using for years now that helps me save money on clothes is an app called ShopTagger. And what ShopTagger does is it allows you to save your favorite clothing items online and get notified about either when they go on sale or come back in stock. So basically ShopTagger keeps an eye out for you 24 seven so you can always save money and you can either get notified through email mobile push, or you can get push notifications right on your phone if you go ahead and download their app. And another great thing that you can do is create different wish lists in your ShopTagger account like you see I've done here, uh, just to keep everything nice and organized. You can even view coupon codes at checkout as well, which is a new feature that I really like. So if you guys are into fashion and into saving money, be sure to check this out immediately and download the ShopTagger button right now. I'll be sure to go ahead and put that download link down in the description below. Number four, we got hoodies. Now at the end of the day, you want something that you can easily just stuff in your backpack and take out whenever you need it. Not a big old biker jacket, leather jacket, bomber. Nothing beats a simple hoodie. They're comfy and something that you can lend to your girl if she's cold or if she just wants to rock something of yours. Right here is a really great new hoodie that I just received from Bodiskins. This is a really great brand that is definitely worth checking out as well. I actually just found out about them probably four months ago. They're actually really known for their awesome leather jackets as you see here. It's honestly probably one of the best quality leather jackets I've ever owned. And by the way, just to let you guys know, these clothing brands that I'm rocking in today's video, they didn't sponsor me or anything like that. Some of these brands were just generous enough to send me out some free clothes and the rest of them I just legit bought myself. But either way, for those of you that are new, these are brands that I actually really like and I highly recommend. Number five, we have classic sneakers. Now, sneakers are pretty much the main event when it comes to any outfit. If you got a dope outfit on, I mean, that's cool, but the real question is, you know, what are you rocking on your feet? Now, one thing that you can never go wrong with is rocking classic sneakers. Old school Vans, Continental 80s, I actually just picked up these Tailwind 79s, Stranger Things collaboration, which I think are great for back to school. Also, you can never go wrong with a Nike Cortez. My boys over at Offsides SD actually just hooked me up with these bad boys a few weeks ago. They got me a great deal on the shoe that I couldn't get elsewhere. These are actually from the Shoe Dog Collection, which feature the original Nike swoosh. So they got some good history to them. By the way, if you guys wanna check out Offsides SD and get a good deal on sneakers, I'll be sure to put their info down in the description below. All right, now moving on, number six, we have sports socks. As you just saw me wearing, sports socks have been coming in style more than ever now. Having different designs or patterns on your socks will actually really take your style up a notch. As you can see, it's a subtle addition to your outfit but really upgrades your look as a whole. I usually get my socks at ASOS.com at a great price so again I'll be sure to put that info down in the description. Number seven is casual button-ups. Now you definitely don't want to rock a dress shirt to school in my opinion just because um, it's a little over the top, it's a little too much. So go with a casual button up instead and this will look really great. Honestly, it's just a more realistic approach to dressing nice and classic at school. Number eight, we have sweatpants. Now, I don't like to really use the term jogger just because the second I do, I get a lot of people that flip out on me and tell me how joggers are just not in style anymore. But at the end of the day, sweatpants are basically joggers. It's like the same thing. And yes, they are very much in style. You go to ASOS.com, one of the biggest fashion 
you know websites on the internet and if you go to the men's category you're gonna see joggers right there but anyways joggers or should I say sweatpants are another perfect option for staying comfy and looking great as well and honestly for me this is actually a look that I go for most of the time number nine we got track suits now a great thing about track suits is obviously they look cool but they also take no effort at all when it comes to styling them I would highly recommend every dude to have at least one track suit in his wardrobe that you can wear maybe once a week or once a month whatever you prefer it's just just a really easy outfit that is easy to throw on if you're in a rush. Number 10 is a nice pair of glasses. Now for all my four-eyed nerds like me, again this is not sponsored, however Sunglasses USA is a great brand that has some very stylish glasses at very affordable prices, so I'll link them below. And number 11, now an idea that I want you guys to think about is it's okay to follow the trends. I know a lot of YouTubers and fashion bloggers say to stick to classic pieces and basics and things like that, you know, to stay away from dressing like the kids these days. I think I've even probably said this in a past video of mine as well, to be honest. But honestly, trying out new trends is fun. It's exciting. It allows you to always rock new things, to be able to switch, you know, your style up. Opposed to sticking strictly to classic pieces and, you know, that gentleman's look. Not saying that the gentleman's look is bad, you know, by any means. I love that style. All I'm saying is that it's great to have a balance. You know, there's a time and place for everything. There may be times where, yeah, you need to dress classy and gentleman-like, and then there may be times where you just want to, you know, rock some streetwear and rock, you know, the newest trends. All I'm saying is don't stay stuck on one thing, one style, you guys. Live a little more free and be a little more open. New trends are fun, so be fun, and go ahead and step outside of your shell a little bit. Which leads me into today's motivational message of the day, and that is do different. Don't stay stuck in a routine. Having routines and regimens, yeah, it can be great, but it's also good to switch things up sometimes. Be in a constant state of newness. You know, this is how you live an exciting life. Step outside of your box, try new things, try something that you may not even be good at, fail at something, and then go ahead and try again and get better. Look, the best way to grow yourself mentally, emotionally, physically, spiritually, is to really push yourself and to stretch yourself. Remember, life begins at the end of your comfort zone. So I hope you guys dug today's video. If you did, be sure to give it a nice big thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, and be sure to hit that notifications button to be informed when I drop some new content. And I'll see you guys soon. My name is Dre Drexler, Shaka Bra.